We did some prospecting, we came upon a vein. Looks like it's a copper vein. A copper ore could be gleaned from a couple different resources, such as calcopyrite and copper. Fortunately, it's in full straight. You can you can just hear them. There's a whole bunch. I wonder if there's actually dungeon around here. There's lots of them. Maybe underneath us. Maybe above us. Somewhere around here. Hmm. See, look at all these guys. Oh my goodness. up you see the iron veins they can spread like across three different three different chunks oh shoot what's that oh hello Oh! Shoot. Run away. I can't, I can't harvest that. I need higher quality, which is why we need that iron. That iron pickaxe head. I'm just gonna kill these things so I can get that reward for killing monsters. And it levels up the sword. Anyways, we're going to continue to... I just want to show you that. Oops. I want to show you guys my pickaxe just leveled up. You can see suddenly a flash of light shines. Plus one mining level. And if I actually inspect my pickaxe and hold shift down, it'll tell me my mine level is zero, 01, which is copper. Tool level is 2. Uh, and I also got luck. So I wonder if we come over here. We can now dig up this extra stuff. I found the zombie spawner. Check that out. There it is. Now we're cooking. A bunch of zombies just falling down in here. Careful not to get a really bad zombie like that guy. See how he's bad news. It's a pretty sweet setup, actually. Let's see if we could actually get around it. So. want the center of it. One. Let's put that right there. Let's get above it. I'm sure it's hard for you guys to see that. Let me get a couple of these. Zombie brains. Okay. I hear you. Oh, there they are. 
So what I need to do is actually get in there and put... Get out. Oh shoot. Look at this little guy. He's quick. What if I don't light up the place they're gonna spawn in the unlit area? So if I push F7, I know that all this is lit up. So let's go ahead and block this off, just in case. And while we're at it, we're gonna block this part off. But we know they can't spawn in here. What if we take that torch? Thanks. What do we got here? All right, we'll take all this. We got chrome dust, copper ingot. We'll also take that. What do we have in here? Ooh, lead, tin, copper, iridium. Take all that too, what's that? Purple drink, how about lemonade? Oh, okay. Well, there you go. We got our first spawner. I'm sure, I'm not going to try to kill that thing because it's going to take forever. Turn you off. And let's go ahead and just block that up. Oh shit, an Enderman. Look at that. Got him. I don't know if you noticed that, but in that dungeon I got this fatty cheeseburger. Look at all those bad boys. Go ahead and eat this. Cheeseburgers for days. Wow, look at all that. Beautiful. And still need to get rid of something. I did not like my tools breaking and I had to go all the way back to camp to replace it so I brought my tool station with my flint down here and we can go ahead and continue to dig or mine rather with our pickaxe without going back and it looks like we got all of our our cobblestone Let's see completed and we get a reward iron pickaxe and what else do we get here let's go with a loot bag since those two things aren't really that important at the moment. Actually, shovel head will be important. But in order to do that, we need to clear. We need to clear some inventory space. So just for now, we're going to clear some inventory space. And we're going to repair our tools. And let's claim our reward. So this opens up tin, copper, aluminum, iron. Let's go ahead and claim our reward, our iron shovel claim. Let's go ahead and upgrade. So it says I already can mine copper and it's a level one and we were, we got that with the increase uh, with the boost with our mining. But now it says my mining speed has increased to six or yep, increased to six and I can mine iron now, which is great. And let's go ahead and Oops, I didn't do it, sorry. Let's go ahead and pick it up. There it is. Let's do the same thing with our 
their shovel. And now we have this beautiful iron pickaxe.